So now let's go over how to make your first online purchase using cryptocurrency. Cryptocurrency was designed to replace our traditional financial system and provide a more secure and anonymous way for people to make transactions. Cryptocurrency is still a new technology and most companies have not integrated cryptocurrency into their payment system yet. But as the cryptocurrency market grows, more and more companies will begin to accept payments in cryptocurrency such as Bitcoin every year. This is ranging from online e-commerce businesses to local mom and pop stores around the world. Eventually, I believe almost all businesses will accept cryptocurrency due to its innovative security features, decentralization, and low transaction costs. Purchasing items with cryptocurrency is just as easy, if not easier, than checking out with the credit card. When paying online with the credit card, you typically have to enter the full credit card number each time you make a purchase. Some sites such as Overstock.com allow you to pay with cryptocurrency by simply logging into your Coinbase account during the checkout. This is similar to making payments using a service such as PayPal. So let's head over to Overstock.com and go over the steps to make a purchase using cryptocurrency. Overstock.com is one of the sites that actually already accepts Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies as payment. But before we start shopping, let's get some more information about Bitcoin on Overstock. So at Overstock.com slash Bitcoin, the first thing they actually have is a video of the CEO talking about the future of Bitcoin in business. Seems like the Overstock company really believes in the technology behind Bitcoin. It says here that you can buy thousands of products on Overstock.com with Bitcoin and they have partnered with Coinbase to become the first major retailer to accept the digital currency. So the first step is to get some Bitcoin, which we've already gone over earlier in this section. Next, you shop for the product or products that you want on Overstock.com, and then you simply check out. You'll have the option to select cryptocurrency as a form of payment during your checkout. So let's go shopping. I've been doing a lot more jogging on the treadmill recently, and I've been wanting to get one of those Fitbits to go around my wrist. I've been using my cell phone to count my steps, but I really don't like having it in my hand or in my pocket while walking. So let's see what they have on Overstock. This Fitbit Flex Tracker here looks like a pretty good deal. Let's click on this one to check it out. So I can get this Fitbit Flex Tracker for only $50, but they only have it in the color of teal. I'm not really trying to make any fashion statements, so that'll work for me. Let's add it to the cart. So it looks like my total is $50.49. My shipping is free. So let's check out now. If you already have an account on Overstock.com, you can go ahead and sign in to fill out the address and other information. If not, you can simply continue as guest. So now you should be on the checkout page. If you look under payment information, you can see all the different forms of payment you can use. Overstock actually allows you to pay with other cryptocurrencies such as Ethereum, Litecoin, and Monero as well. But for this transaction, I'm going to use Bitcoin. So after you've verified your information and selected your payment method, look on the right hand side and click on Submit Order. And here's where you actually send the Bitcoin using your wallet address. If you look in the center, you actually have the option to use a Coinbase account. I'm going to click that now. You will then be prompted to log into your Coinbase account and select the wallet. I'm signed in as Mr. Miyagi 3000. I'm going to select my Bitcoin wallet here and then click pay the $50.49. And there we have it. Your order has been placed. You'll receive an order confirmation from Overstock.com, but let's go over to Coinbase and see if we can see the transaction. All right, so I'm logged into my Coinbase account. So let's see if we can see the transaction we just made on Overstock. Let's go up to the top menu and click on the Accounts tab. Once you're on the Accounts menu, select the Bitcoin wallet that you used to make your purchase. On the right hand side, you should be able to see the transactions. And here's the order I just placed on Overstock. I paid $50.49, which is about 0.003951 Bitcoins. If you click on View Receipt, you can also see the invoice for the transaction. So that's all it is to it for making a purchase using cryptocurrency. It's a simple and easy process, and I hope more businesses will start accepting it soon. I'll see you in the next video.